No, we did not go all the way through. That's right, that's the key. All right. When we have this set up here, there's a marker on the drill bit. We can adjust the amount of depth okay. this drill will drill. All right. Because the key is that when we have two metals and we won't just want to remove one, we don't want to drill all the way through the weld because okay. we got a resistant spa weld we want back a good together. Base for the, we want a good base for the new weld. Correct. Excellent. So therefore, this actually controls the depth for you so you don't accidentally drill all the way through the metal. All right. Now you were telling me that this is a regulated speed so that we don't have to worry that, oh my gosh, I've got to go faster and I'm going to burn these bits up uh, too quickly. Right. What, what's the actual drill speed, Ron? The free speed is 1,000 RPM. The drill speed is about seven to 800 RPM. Okay, so it, it keeps it at a relatively low speed yes. to try to keep the bit cooler. That's right. All right. Works on steel, aluminum, borons. Yes, it's obviously designed for the high strength steels, All right. which is the harder ones to remove. Uh, the system is unique to any other system out there because we have an ability to, uh, first of all, we use a tungsten carbide bit that is extremely hard, right? Yes. So it's almost like glass. All right. The problem with the bits, they're very expensive and in the past they haven't lasted very long. But with, with this we use a two flute drill bit instead of three and therefore we get less vibration into the weld. We're removing the metals uh, quicker and that way they last longer. The other key to this tool is that it has a feature where the other w drills more or less, well, as you push the lever, the drill hits into the metal and starts spinning. Okay. And many times it gets very brittle and you, you destroy the drill bit. With this one, we can actually adjust it to where the the drill is actually touching. Okay, here. so we're not having a collision of the, the have, two dissimilar metals at the same good. time. Exactly. So as you can see, I actually push this lever in. It's a two piston system. One is pushing the piston in when we're not spinning. And then okay. you can see the second button here. As I push harder, it will start spinning. And you can see you get a lot cleaner transmission into here to the steel. instead of slamming it into it with the drill bit with the other one. So, so these two systems makes it uh, very unique and they will last, the drill bits will last about five times longer than on other conventional drills like this. Very nice. Thanks, Ron. I appreciate yeah. the opportunity to even try this tool out. Yeah, thank you very much.